I am James Houghton. And I'm Chris Borthman. And we are here with the StopTech C43 Time Tactic Brake System. Today we'll be installing it on the K-Tune Accurate Integra Type R. And we'll be installing it on the K-Tune Honda Civic in a few weeks. This is their Gen 5 competition caliper. It's called their C43 caliper. It's uh, pretty amazing. This, the uh, StopTech line of trophy calipers is already very impressive stuff. But the C43 have gone even one step further with, uh, with mainly the weight reduction. There's holes, holes uh, machine everywhere. There's extra extra gaps in certain areas for venting. I don't know if you can see in the camera there. And this caliper, compared to the caliper that we ran last year, actually has a two millimeter larger uh, front piston. Uh, so that should help with the uh, brake bias. And uh, super excited to be using this caliper in 2018. Uh, and this is the uh, full floating two piece rotor that comes with the kit. Uh, so the size of this rotor is actually 12.19 inches by 1.2 five inches thick. Uh, and you can see here it's a full floating disc so that will help with uh, keeping uh, heat out of your bearing uh, and as well with a two-piece rotor the friction ring is separate from the actual rotor hat uh, so now you get a little bit more weight reduction as well because this is a little bit in the center. And if you look here on the inside, it's hard to see in the photo here, um, it actually has a very unique vein design on the inside here. The vein design is called what again? A pillar vein. A pillar vein which I've never seen. It, there's a lot of veins kind of stacked on top of one another, so that should really help with cooling as well. It's a very, very, very well engineered piece, much like everything we've stopped in. We ran the previous generation of this kit in the 2017 season, which was the StopTech STR43. Uh, we ran 23 days of the track, we ran 13 events, one set of rotors. crazy, crazy high G-forces all year, even, you know, whether it was low-speed tracks that weren't huge aero-based tracks, or at Road Atlanta, where when we were at Grid Life South, we saw a peak of 2.5 Gs under braking. That's very back straight going into 10 8. So, the system is absolutely amazing, um, very good with longevity, and very good with cooling, and we're really excited to try on both of our cars the, uh, the newest generation of this. Well, StopTech has actually engineered this kit for the car, for the application, Make sure that your uh, biasing is correct, um, so you don't have to worry about those types of issues, which is incredibly important when you're trying to make sure the car is stable under braking. Uh, and I'm super excited to have it on the car. Uh, I think it, you know if we get anywhere close to the kind of braking G-forces that James has seen, I think we'll be moving forward for sure. So awesome. thank you very much. Thank you. So one thing that's super easy to forget is washing the rotor. So StopTech rec recommends washing the rotor with soap and water and then using brake clean to make sure it's completely free of any oil before you install it on the car. That concludes the installation of our StopTech C43 Time Attack Brake Kit. We hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please subscribe and share.